Oh dear, oh dear. I just came back from a very long walk. I know I look a little fancy, but it's only because I really wanted to try these new little cardigans that I've got. I got them in so many different colors and I think they're really pretty. Uh, and I wore like three layers underneath this because so that I'm not cold basically. It's because obviously it's always so cold in London. Um, so I do look a little bulky in this one, but very nice, right? Um, I just took off my trainers everything is hurting so bad but I just thought you know what let me just do like a little video because I was just feeling like I haven't done these in such a long time I do have some parcels listen this is one thing that always makes me so happy when I come home or even when I'm just home and not going anywhere is the parcels duh I don't know it's always like a surprise from me to me most of the time and um yeah i'm excited to see what this is um as far as i know i know that one of these actually has um epsom salt so i really want to start doing this drink every night which is that you know you add epsom salt some lemon juice some apple cider vinegar in some water and then you drink it every night and it kind of works as a laxative as well as it just cleanses your system and it's really good for apparently your skin it's kind of like a detox and I want to do that every night. It also, by the way, helps to lose weight. That's what I have researched. So I thought maybe I should try doing these things, you know. I mean, I'm currently obviously obsessed with the smoothies. Let me show you guys my smoothie. I think you already have seen it like a hundred times on my uh, Instagram. Here it is. So I just made it right now. So I just thought before I come back to my room and into my comfort zone, I just literally ran to the kitchen. And the first thing I did was make some green tea. I have some organic green tea from Waitress and um i have a salad that i made two days ago still going it's still fresh but this is the last portion it's gonna now finish and i quickly made the smoothie and i think in my previous vlog i showed you guys how i made this smoothie all i do is cucumber celery and some berries obviously a little bit of water and i just mix it in my mixer and today i made like a lot of this this is a lot this is a lot and I also added some seeds. So basically one thing that I've been trying to do quite a lot just to be healthy, you know, you get like those little powders, if you know what I'm saying, the powders, my hair is a mess because it was raining outside. So the powders, which was like um, flax seed, shia seeds, sesame seeds, sunflower seeds. It's like a mix of seeds crushed into a powder. I bought that from Lidl, you know. Uh, you can also do that at home, just mix different seeds and just crush it into a powder and literally just add it to your salads, to your smoothies, to your dinners, whatever, right? And I've just added some on this. Can you see that? Can you see that? That's what I've done. It actually tastes like nothing. I told you guys in my previous video also. But anyway, I'm going to have this. Mmm. And it's pretty cold. I also added some lemon on top of this today. Wow, it's pretty cold. And, and I'm just letting you guys know these things because I think everybody on my Instagram is always like a part of my journey, whether it was with inter uh, intermittent fasting or a little bit of weight loss, doing weights, doing waist training and all of that. So yeah, I have done like these little substitutes. Like for example, I don't drink Pepsi 7up. Energy drinks? Not at all so no squash like literally nothing and this is what i'm doing instead right so it kind of makes up for that you can make a huge glass like this and just kind of have it throughout the day if you're not if you're not a smoothie fan because i am really not i just like water and some teas i really don't like anything else in between so but anyway this is a healthy alternative and you can finish it throughout the day you know just have it a little bit throughout the day and you're fine so here's the funny thing i made the green tea this is the smoothie with the seeds. Do you see that? And uh, here is the salad that I made with like eggs, avocados, kidney beans, sweet corns. You see so many things there. Oh, what else? Cucumber, capsicum. And if you want to see the salad dressing, just go to my TikTok, which is me, Lady Isha, and you will see the salad dressing there. It's super easy, very healthy, good for weight loss and super good for digestion also. And it's very easy and very yummy, actually. So here's a story. When I was walking, I actually have a new walking partner. So me and my friend were walking and we walked so much. I'm like, oh my God, you know what? Let's just go to Tesco. Like, just, let's just get some drink or whatever. She gets herself an energy drink and I don't drink that. So I got some innocent smoothie, whatever, can't remember. And I was like, wait a minute. You know what? I really love sushi and I was hungry. So this was kind of a little bit of an impulsive purchase. 
which is weird. I mean, Tesco sushi, I'm not sure. But, well, I have to roll with it now because this was such an impulsive thing because we were so hungry. You know when you're hungry and you see Tesco in front of you, you just buy random stuff. This is another random stuff that I got. But anyway, I'm just going to eat that with a salad and just kind of call it a day, right? And even before I went for the walk, I walked for three hours. Can you believe that? Before I went for the walk, I also had this exact salad. A little more than this. And some zawa cut. And yeah. And after this, I'm going to clean around here because I have so much mess around here. I don't know what I was doing, but I need to clean that up as well. And then I'm going to open up these beautiful parcels and see what I got today. I don't know what I got. Um, and here is the tripod, by the way. This is the tripod where I hang my phone every time I am making like a video call to my friend or when I make Instagram stories or whatever. So this is where my phone actually is always hanging out. Oh my God. If only this was like some Novikov nice fancy sushi i love their sushi the most anyway i think i'm just gonna call this my dinner tonight right to be honest it's just 7 p.m it's not even dinner time actually we always have our dinner around 8 nobody's even home at this time to be honest i'm kind of just here on my own so anyway i'm gonna show you my full look before i get into this because every time i eat i kind of like to you know watch netflix with it so I'm gonna enjoy this. Let me show you guys my full look first. Hold on. So here is the full look. I honestly love this cardigan. It's so nice. And I've also been working out on my legs quite a lot because I want like wider hips, thicker thighs and all that. So we're working on that right now. And you see my vanity at the back? It needs a fresh paint because I have made it disgusting. Yes, this is the look today. I mean, I look so Chanel. I mean, look at the shoes, so weird. I kind of find them so cute as well at the same time, you know? Um, they give me like an old auntie look. But to be honest, I like it. I don't mind. And yes, this is the cardigan I was talking about. I have this in a few colors and they're so gorgeous. And especially the buttons are just super pretty. Um, and I, yeah, I'm wearing a vest underneath and stuff. Anyway, um, I need some food. And I also have to show you one more thing that was, again, a very, very impulsive buy when I was coming back from the walk. Let me show you guys that first. <laughs> This is what I'm talking about. Lemon and vanilla chocolate. No, lemon and white chocolate muffins. I never heard of this particular flavor before. And I was like, oh my god, you know what? Maybe I need to get it. And this was like a shop literally next to Tesco where me and my friend went. And I saw these and I'm like, oh my god, I need to get this. Again, when you're hungry, try never to go to any shops because this is the kind of stuff you end up buying and it's obviously not right. The only thing good I see here is uh, the smoothie, the green tea, obviously the salad, and, and the rest of it is just such an indulgence somehow. And I'll try not to have one of these, but obviously that's not happening in my world. Obviously I'm going to have one of these. Oh my god, it says new recipe. There you go. I'm thinking maybe this might be my new obsession. I hope not, but it looks like it. It is so late at night and I forgot that <laughs> the rest of the salad that I just freshly made later today it needed some sesame seeds i think that's like one type of seed that i always add to my salads there are so many benefits of sesame seeds it's crazy and obviously i have here some more organic green tea that i'm gonna drink before i go to sleep i also have another delivery which came in at around like 9 pm that i'm gonna open with you guys i'm super excited so let's go inside and let me put this in the fridge first I don't know if you're supposed to reuse this cling film all the time, but, well, I do. So now I have more salad for the next two days. All right, so that's the next delivery that came in. I actually have a flower subscription, and this is the first delivery that came in from them, which is so cool. I've taken out two of these vases that I'm going to probably use, one of these, and then one of these, and maybe if they are huge enough, I don't know, it's the first delivery. So if, you, if they're huge enough, then I can maybe divide them in two parts. Keep one in my room, one in the living room or something, you know, but we'll see. So let's open this first. It's called Arena Flowers. And for every little bouquet that they send you, they actually plant a flower, so... They do something morally really correct, which is, I'm such a fan of that. It's so cool. They're supporting the environment in so many ways. Let's see what we got. Oh, oh my God, that's so cool. I also have a new yellow dress to match the flowers that I can actually then 
take a photo and post on the feed. So I think this is supposed to be the flower that I got this month, right? Yes, it also tells you how to cut them and how to arrange them, I guess. So cool. Okay. Ooh. Wait, where are the roses? Or oh, maybe they're underneath. Oh, wow. And they're fresh buds, so they're gonna look even nicer in a few days' time. That is so cool, and they actually look very fresh and hydrated also, if that makes sense. Okay, so it's coming together quite nicely. These are the long ones. I've taken some leaves off from the bottom, and these I have cut short a little bit because this was here is a little shorter than the other one. But look at how gorgeous. Oh my god. I like how this kind of flares out, you know, do you see that? And these roses go in here. I like how the roses are so like fresh, like fresh blooms. They're gonna look nicer in like a few days time, I believe. And this is the other one. Oopsie. Oh god, I'm so bad at that. I need some practice with this thing. <laughs> I wish it had a bit more roses in there, you know? It looks like a gift. I tied the ribbon from the box right onto the glass. I just thought it looks cute. Okay, I think I found a better place, which is near the TV right here. Oh, that's cute. I really wish there was more roses in there, to be honest. I still wish we had some more roses because there was only like 10 roses, so 4 in this one, I guess. And the rest in the bigger one. But it's still cute though. And here is the bigger one. I've put some more flowers in this one. I think this one looks a bit more organized. I like it. The flowers are now where they belong, right next to my new polishes. Okay, I need to organize them a little bit because I have way too many nail polishes than I need. I don't know why I keep having them here, but... Never mind, these look gorgeous, however, right near the window. So cute. I think next time, to be honest, I'm just gonna keep all of them in just one vase. So this is kind of like a new hobby that now I have every month. I know that's very messed up here. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's the yellow bits falling off. Oopsie. But yes, this is a lot of mess here. I just have way too much nail polish, more than I need. Uh, and this is not even half of it, by the way. These are just the ones that I randomly use. Anyhow, never mind. These are gorgeous. Very, very pretty. I just think, you know what, next time I'm just gonna make one big vase and I'll be more happy. But yeah, this is where they belong and they look so cute. Do you also see that um, yellow nail color matching so perfectly? Right next to the window. This is perfect. Oh, by the way, do you guys remember this DIY? Yep. And here we are. This is the next day. I've been recording content all day long and every time I go full work mode, I tend to do this thing where, you know, I stay in my own zone. Nobody disturbs me and I usually eat from the outside, to be honest. And I'm not very good eating with these um, sticks. It's something I still have to practice. Ouch. And they broke. There you go. I have another one here, so that's okay. So I'm gonna have half of this. I am a fan of sushi, you probably have already guessed. I obviously love food the most, maybe probably even more than human beings. This is my little break basically and I'm obviously I'm gonna be struggling with the sticks here. Ouchie! And I'm trying not to break them. <laughs> mm, this is so delicious. Maybe one time, mm, let's have the avocado one. Maybe one time I should do like a mukbang. I think I've done a few of those, especially on my Instagram. Maybe I need to do them on my channel here. I don't know if that's something you guys are interested in. Ladies, please let me know. Okay, I'm gonna get a little messy here. Mm. Ah! 